Hey guys, it's Kip from Famous by Friday Pickle Law. Got a brand new paddle to review. Very excited about this. It is the new Diadem Icon 2. If you watch my paddle review on the original Diadem Icon, it was a paddle that I liked a lot and I played with for quite a while. It was a great paddle. There are still loyalists out there that will just not put that paddle away. They love it. So I'm very excited to see what Diadem has done with the Icon 2. The first thing you notice when you get it out of the box, is the, Diodon, the, the Icon 2 does not have the original surface of the Icon. The Icon was, and I'll kind of angle the paddle here, the Icon was kind of velvety, almost fabric-y. Um, I think in the original video I said something about it. it was like walking down the halls of Graceland. The new surface they took from the Diadem Vice paddle. It's an RP2 technology face. It's a two component polypropylene that I that Diadem says is going to increase spin. I didn't really find that much spin with the Diadem Vice, so I'm kind of anxious to see if they maybe change that a little bit. What I worry about is the coating, and I always worry about every time I see these two words together, I get a little concerned. The coating, the surface has grit paint. And anytime I see grit paint, I think it's gonna wear off. It's just it it is what it is. It's going to wear off. So I do worry about that, but we'll, I'm going to get it out and hit it with a little bit and see how it does. So they took the surface from the vise. They took the core from the Warrior. Now they slimmed it down. This is 13.7 millimeters. The Warrior was obviously much thicker. It is 16 millimeters. So they thinned it down, but it's still the three layers of the Warrior paddle. Now that says it's going, uh, Ditem says that's going to be a comfortable, dampening, and powerful feel. Dampening and powerful usually don't go together very well, but we'll see how that works. Also, they took the foam, and a lot of companies think of Yola, uh, who's done it to great success. They took foam and put it around the edges. They took that from one of the Diadem tennis rackets. So they said that'll give it stable, uh, increased stability, and increase sweet spot, which we found with other paddles that when you inject foam around the edges, it does increase the sweet spot. So it's, it's, it's fascinating that this paddle has so many other paddles from Diadem in it, but it didn't really take much from the Icon and they called it an Icon too. We will see. I'm headed out to the courts right now. This, this paddle does come in two different sizes. There's a 16 by eight, more traditional size and a 16 and a half by 8.25, uh, kind of elongated size. The original icon came in two different weights. It didn't come in two different sizes. It came in more of the traditional size, I believe, if I remember correctly, and I might be wrong on that. We're headed out to the courts right now. Hope you are too. Very excited to hit this paddle. Love the original icon. I hope this one holds up. All right, guys, I'll be back.
Hey guys, back. Just spent the last couple of weeks with the new Didem Icon 2 paddle. This paddle was really fun to hit. I really had high expectations for this paddle because I think I said in the opener how much I love the original Didem Icon. Really, really, really was excited about getting out there and hitting this paddle. There were several people in line that were just waiting to hit this paddle because they were Didem Icon enthusiasts. This paddle is a lot different than the Icon. We go through some of the attributes. It is consistent. It is fairly accurate. It does have a little power, but not power where you're going to throw balls out and, you know, just those unnecessary flyers or inconvenient flyers that you think, oh, I just swung that paddle exactly the same, or I tried to block it and it shot up instead of, you know, staying level. It, it doesn't have those. It does stay within the court, which is really nice. It has a lot of spin, which really surprised me because uh, I think I said in the opener that it has the RP2 technology on the face that the Diadem Vice had, and the Vice didn't have, it had loads of power, but it didn't have much spin. The Icon 2 really spins really well. It, you can really spin it. You can actually see the ball jump. So that's really cool. It does some things really well. Adequate defensively. Good resets. Like I said, good accuracy, good consistency. It is quick through the air. Once again, I think thinner paddles might be that, and that's just mental, I'm sure. I think they're a little bit quicker through the air. They are headlight. Neither one are cumbersome to use. But, and there's always a but, but I think Diadem did a bit of a disservice by naming this icon at all. I said in the intro that they stole the core from the warrior, they stole the face from the vice, they stole the foam from a tennis racket. They really didn't keep any of the components of the original Diadem vice except maybe the shape, you know, the, the thin, the thin paddle. Other than that, all of the components are kind of borrowed from other paddles and they're good components. But I kind of wonder if, 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 if they should have maybe named it something else. And I think that's a minor thing, but when you come from the original Diadem Icon, all the people that tried this just they really wanted to like this so much because they love their icon so much that it didn't really fit the game that they played with their icon. So they went 100%, went back to their old icon. Now, this is not a bad paddle. It's actually a really, really good paddle. And I think maybe part of the problem with me was I expected it to be more icon-ish, where it would have those traits of the old icon. So, uh, so I kind of went out there with that mindset as well. And then I had to kind of change that mindset as I went to just judge the paddle on what it is. It's a really good paddle. It's a lot of fun to hit. There is zero vibration on here, which would be, it's just really soft. 
I think in the opening I said something about diadem says this is comfortable, dampening, and powerful. And I said those two words usually don't go together, the dampening and the powerful. But it is. It actually does those things very well. Everything that diadem says this paddle will do, it does. The sweet spot's really large, very stable paddle, increased spin, all of those things. I almost wish they would have named it something else so it didn't because none of when you name something something too you accept you almost expect part of those components to be from the original or some of those traits and this really is I, I think this would be a great standalone paddle so I almost wish they wouldn't have named it icon 2 at all I I really that's my only complaint and I don't even know if that's a complaint. Maybe a suggestion. I don't know. It's a good paddle. I'm really anxious to see if any of you played with this, any of you tried it, what your thoughts were, whether it's going in your bag. Now, I usually end these with if it's going in my bag or not. It could. It really could. It does so many things well. It doesn't really do anything. There's no wow moment. Other than the spin's pretty good, there's no just wow moment where you're thinking this is the magic stick. But it does everything really well. I put, I did put a little weight on here when I played with it some more, and that seemed to help with you know getting the ball through the zone. I, once again, I'll go back to I'm a kind of a defensive player, and it really helped with the defensive aspects of this paddle. As far as accuracy, the 16. The more, tra more traditional size paddle, the 16 by 8 paddle, was a lot more accurate than the elongated paddle, which we, you which we expect because you this one probably this one had more power, but this paddle really held up well. I'm anxious to see if you guys tried this or not. If you if you've hit with it, if you like it, what your thoughts are, please let me know. Please hit like. Please hit subscribe. Thank you for stopping by. The diadem. Icon 2. Interesting paddle. It is, it is a good paddle. All right, guys. We'll be back. I'm so disappointed.